Okay, uh, it's the report of the alcohol density problem lab. Here is the problem statement. A traditional way of determining the concentration of alcohol in alcoholic beverages is by measuring the density of the solution, since the two characteristics of the solution are related. And it says about something in Canadian laws. So we need to determine which category these beverages belong to beverage A and beverage B so my approach to this solution is to find the densities of the solutions uh, first to find the 70% density of the 70% solution then the density of the beverage A and beverage B also uh you know also i found the densities of the borders of the categories that is 22.9 and 7 percent and 1.2 also 0.5 percent so here is my approach uh, in order to find the 10 milliliter milliliter i, I set 10 milliliter as a standard and in order to find the certain mixture percentage of that let's say n percent I use this formula that 10 multiplied by n divided by 70 milliliter and uh, complementary value of it of is the water that is 10 minus that value which gives us total 10 milliliter of the product is the desired n percent of the mixture in the result. For example, in order to get 22.9% of the mixture, I mixed 3.2715 ml of 70% of mix and complementary of to the 10 ml of mixture. So here are the uh, all the values that I calculated that I will need to do the laboratory in order to find uh, the thresholds first of all um, let's find the uh, let's calculate 22.9 percent of the mixture so we need uh, 3.27 uh, uh, milliliters of 70 percent alcohol uh, let's take scale we need some glassware beakers this now uh, 2.70 mixture and we need some water uh, 70.75 which gives us 9.6128 grams that I have recorded uh, to, to the Excel worksheet and in order to find the density we divide the mass uh, by the volume which gives us 0 point, uh, 0.96 128 gram per mol mil milliliters and after calculating all the values for 7% of the mixture 1.2% of the mixture and 0.0% of the mixture I compared the values that I calculated for A that I'm going to calculate right now average B we need some Speakers, order, and scale. It gives us nine point seventy nine approximately grams of the beverage A record to the Excel data sheet which gives us 0 0.97943 um, 
at this point we can compare with the threshold values and we can see that uh, beverage A is has the more density than 22.9% and uh, less than 7% and if we watch the table uh, on the right you can see the values for the each category these values represent the upper bound for each category uh, that is when we compare we if it is less than this value then it belongs to the left category so our uh, threshold our average a is less than 22.9 so it is fourth category so we record the answer and uh, let's calculate the value for the B that will be 9.183 grams we record that to the data sheet and if we calculate our density we can see 0 0.992 approximately and it is more than 70% sample and less than 22.9 sample which gives us um, the category number 5 we record that to the data we will get the answer and the data sheet is ready to submit